The question, what influenced Rick Steves to become a travel writer? Writing was an evolution of Rick Steves' travel experience. He first traveled to Europe with his father when he was 14. He first traveled to Europe without adult supervision when he was 18. He has referred to that trip as Europe through the gutter and described it as a massive learning experience about how to travel. Each summer he would do these travels to Europe. He wasn't thinking about being a travel writer, but he was fastidious about maintaining a personal travel journal. He would buy a new notebook before each trip, and every day fill it with his experiences. His source of income was teaching piano lessons. He had a little leased office called Steve's Studios. He went to a travel class from a man who had traveled to Istanbul. Rick found the class very poorly constructed and presented and convinced himself he could do better and set himself up to teach an eight-session class at the Experimental College in Washington on traveling to Europe. He would share his experiences so others could do it themselves. 100 people signed up and paid $2 each. Over time, teaching people how to travel became more of a business than teaching them how to play the piano. His aunt suggested he write a book on the subject and the book was essentially just a compilation of his lecture notes. He self-published that book in 1980. His girlfriend typed it and his roommate drew the art. The books were something he took to his lectures in case people wanted to buy them. The business he was making was initially built around the lectures and then expanded into actually taking people on guided tours of Europe, with a continually updated book as an add-on. Steves has said his lectures and writing have evolved in a Maslow's hierarchy of needs manner. Initially he was focused on tips for sustenance, shelter, and safety, and then as he matured he talked and wrote more about the cultures and history of the places he was visiting and then after 9-11, he has pivoted into talking and writing about travel as a political act. But still, the writing is something that results from the talking.